So I often get asked in the YouTube comments as well as over on my Twitch streams, why the hell do I care so much about voice acting and gaming? It's pretty simple. I think that voice acting and gaming just enhances my experience and makes the games that I play overall more fun. Epic Seven has an amazing English dub cast. Unfortunately, most of the stories aren't actually, you know, performed by those voiceover artists. So I decided to invite some friends and do it myself. Basically, have fun and enhance it together with friends. Enjoy. I'm home. Frida, come over here. Which one do you think is better? What are all these doodles? Excuse me, they're promotional posters. Aloha keeps saying his poster is better. Come on, you can be honest with me. Mine looks so much better than the one Shu drew, right? <laughs> to me, they both look like doodles. But I really like the idea of promoting the water park. We should let the whole world know that the legendary Oasis Land is back in business. Hey, you're all saying that because you don't know half of how great Oasis Land was in the past. Once news of its reopening gets out, people will be swarming in and waiting in line for days. You... think? There are already so many fun things in the world these days. I think it'd be nice to promote something extra special about the park. Hmm... Maybe we can make an entire music game themed around it that people have to play on Bluestacks exclusively because of the interface. Oh, and how about the monster water slide Ida has been working day and night on? That's an excellent suggestion! Since we're on the subject, do you think we can ask His Majesty to help us promote it? Is that really necessary? Of course! My dad always said, when you see an opportunity, you should give it your all! If you say so. <laughs> I'm sure everyone will be dying to visit Oasis Land! Of course! I can't wait to see you with my own eyes, right, Frida? Yeah, whatever you say, kid. This slide is really tall. Oh, when you're at the top? Whoa! It looks really fun! Cream! Pastry! Let's go down together! They'll never find out what I did in 1999. <laughs> dot, dot, dot. <laughs> the bodies are still cold. <laughs> the detectives gave up. Uh... Yeah... Right. Trust me, Frida. Come on, ride with me. Ah, how about this? Cream can hold all of us and go down together. <laughs> I think you do where I stored the bodies. Come on, everyone. Time's a wasting, isn't it? <laughs> so the kids are the first victims. <laughs> Oh, shit. I swear, I, I didn't read this ahead of time, buddy. I thought high wizards would be calmer. Hmm. Guess not everyone is like that. Even I didn't scream as badly as Ida. <laughs> you know, it took 10 seconds for the bodies to get cold. It's amazing what a stapler gun does to flesh and bone. Uh, cream? We're going to keep that one a secret. <laughs> I'm just saying, you don't know the things it does to flesh and how it keeps it together in nice little bundles. I mean, it's just proper crime scene etiquette. I mean, when it comes to 15-year-old... Uh, you better cut me off, Sue. We can't keep doing this. <laughs> You're wrong. You can absolutely keep going with this joke. <laughs> 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 
why don't we go check out the man-made beach now? Ugh. Way to ruin the joke, Shu. Meru? They are... Ah, let me formally introduce them to you. Here are my companions, Ross! And the Guardian, Argarchus, us, whatever. Wow, <clears throat> he's so fluffy. L like a big soft plushie. Oh, he's cute, but he's no plushie. Uh, sorry. <clears throat> Arky has been smelling something amazing from the moment we stepped into the park. If you take Arky to whatever is giving off that tasty smell, maybe I could let you off the hook. Not only will I take you to the food stalls, but I'll also let you taste all our food as much as you want. Anything for Mercedes friends. Yippee! Congratulations on the park's reopening. It must have been difficult, putting it all together. But you did a great job. Hope you have a great time here. Dot, dot, dot. Frida, what's wrong? Uh, nothing. It's just another reminder that all of you here are not ordinary people. The, the water slide is th this way. The, the arcade? Oh, it's over there. Hey, is there a place I could sit and relax for a bit? We have sun loungers ready on our man-made beach over there. You guys man-made a beach, you f***ing psychos. It's a bit exhausting to keep up with you youngins. They were all so excited about playing in the oh, water park. Oh, please tell me Crozet's here. Please tell me Crozet's here. <laughs> Fuck. Where did she go? Hmm? Huh? She was right here a few seconds ago. Have you seen a woman about this high, pink haired, and adorable? Uh, um, uh, 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 um, uh, uh, uh. No, no, Sisters, no. should we check the area over there first? Alright! Uh, uh, they're all gone. My social anxiety. What does one need to do to get out, to get just a day of peace around here? Thank you for your kind help, though. Did somebody say peace? It's mother who crowed that course. Wow, was. meat pies and stew, too. Chicken skewers, finally skewers. And churros! <laughs> I want them all! Little lady, I think just buying one of each would be enough. This is exciting and thrilling! I'm so happy! <sighs> Excuse me, but aren't you buying, aren't you a little young to be buying this much food? There are people waiting in line behind you. Oh God, she's a Karen. Alexa, I don't really mind. Uh, L Lady Asaria, but... You mind your own damn business. All of these look so scrumptious I couldn't resist. Let's see how much money I got from Garo. <laughs> There's more than enough for everyone, so come help yourselves. No, nah. There's no way. It looks too scary. What? Are you serious? You think that's scary? You're such a wimp, Helen. That's so mean. If neither of you are brave enough to ride it, I'll step up to show you how it's done. All right, who's next? Off you go, Helen. Yeah. <laughs> it looks just like a real beach here. Lulika, do you see that? There's a surf shop. Oh, you're right. Let's try surfing. 
surfing on a man-made beach. It sounds so exciting. It makes our long trip, I'm sorry. It makes our long trip down here all worth it. Here's your drink. Thank you. The rest of the area on this continent is freezing cold, but here it's so temperate and warm. I heard there's a special device for that. Let's play beach volleyball together! Someone's having the time of her life. Sue! Here, I saved a spot for us. Ugh. I could actually feel my soul trying to leave my body. I call it a soul burn. Relatable, Ida. Uh, Relatable. Mother. Frida, I see you managed to restore the park rather decently. What are you doing here? And you too, Simon. In case you forgot, Oasis Land belongs to the Falls family. It's not for the private ownership of an individual. I excuse me? So you need to return it to the rightful owner. That's not what you promised me. <clears throat> What's going on? You, you do realize my sword is bigger than all of you, right? That may be true, but... I simply gave you an opportunity to restore Oasis Land as a member of the Falls family. But you decided to include outsiders on the family project without consulting us in advance. Turning to outside help clearly proves your lack of competence. So this park should be returned to the original owner, your brother, don't you agree? Considering how you dragged our family name through the mud by begging for money from other people and failing to run this place on your own, you should be grateful that your punishment ends with simply returning the deed to the family. Of course, given your lowly upbringing, I didn't expect much from you from the beginning. Eh, uh, watch your language. <laughs> Don't make me drag you out of here. Oh, we're spinning the block on the ops now, aren't we? Drag them out. Now. Uh, uh, but... What? You want us to drag them over here? Do you not want to get paid? Uh, I mean, they could kick my head off in an instant. I don't think that's a good idea. You're a funny guy, Thog. I'll kill you last. Let's see. There's got to be something we could do for your funeral. Maybe burying you six feet under isn't oh. enough. Oh, I'm out of here! <laughs> Useless worms. You promised me this place in exchange for moving out of the mansion, mother. So I did my best to restore the park so people would visit again. But how could you, after all this time, ask me to return the park's ownership? You never had the right to own any family estate, so I'm just trying to rectify the situation. What's wrong with that? Mother? You're the one who has no rights here! What now? I'm Aloha, the familiar of the Falls family. What? The contract I made with your ancestors dictates that anyone who has Falls blood can control me. Your son can own Oasis land if he's eligible. Aloha, <clears throat> what if? It's okay, Frida, because this guy, your so-called brother, He's not eligible. What? Mother, you said that Oasis Land was our duty! That it was a massive duty! I want to take the duty! The call of duty? Ah, shut up for a second. No! No, no! That's a lie! Lie detector determined you are not the mother! Do you think your son, bereft of false blood whatsoever, <laughs> is dot dot dot? 
weird break in the sentence, eligible to be the owner of Oasis Lane and furthermore, to be the head of the family? Lies. It's all lies. Oh, and uh, here's uh, one more thing. Do you think I really don't know who damaged Oasis Land on purpose? Dot 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 exclamation point. Does that mean? Yes, you did. Wait, they've been the ones who's been behind everything. Have you not been paying attention for the past four chapters? Let me spell it out for you. It was your stepmother. Duh. Those are extremely serious accusations that you're alleging. Can you prove it? Whatever arguments you may try to make, you don't have any ground to stand on. So get out of here! Get- sorry, so get out of here! All of you! This place belongs to me and my son! Dot, 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 internally. Is it happening again? They're going to take away something precious from me. There's absolutely nothing I can do? No way! Question mark exclamation point. <laughs> Everyone in my village lost their jobs because of you. Yeah, what are we going to do when Frida was running around trying her best to revive the park? The only one who stuck around to protect this place was Frida. You're not the owner of this place. We won't allow it. You have no mana. Everyone. Give the park back to Frida. Otherwise, we've got no reason to stay here. We will reset and roam top. Shut it. Just pipe down, you vermin. As long as the ownership rights belong to the head of the Falls family, Oasis Land belongs to me and my son. You're right. Then why don't we ask his majesty? Let's see who he'll see as the true owner of the park. <laughs> what could he possibly know about the situation? He's so far away. Actually, he's right here with us. Dot 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 question mark. Man, I thought I told you my visit here was supposed to be a secret. <laughs> Your majesty. Tywin, how did it go with the task I assigned you earlier? <clears throat> we conducted an extensive and discreet investigation, and it turns out the ones who embezzled the funds from the royal court and destroyed Oasis Land are... Simon, the head of the Falls family, and his mother. And we also confirmed that they had been living an extravagant lifestyle, leeching off of the budget allocated to Oasis Land, to pay local jewelers. And local gangs too, apparently. Of course them, you've got to pay them. You have no proof of that. As a matter of fact, I do. There are several paper trails that lead to the inspector to that you had bribed in return for his writing up false reports so you could keep what happened in Oasis Land under wraps. And that assassin you sent for the messenger too, of course, you know, we, we know about that as well. No. Mother, it's over for us. How will we handle our massive duty now? I've heard enough. The two of them shall be punished for trying to deceive the royal court. No, this can't be happening. Take them away. And Frida. Frida too? Yes, your majesty. People seem to think you're the true owner of Oasis Land. This is where the heads of the Falls family have worked tirelessly to ensure the happiness of all visitors for generations. And after looking around the place, I came to the same conclusion as the public. Thank you. When I return to the palace, I'll finalize the necessary procedures to officially name you the head of House Falls. What? Just continue doing what you've been doing. I know you'll do a great job. I will. Great news, Frida. Did I understand it correctly? 
I'm not dreaming, right? Frida, no one has ever shown the level of affection towards this place like you did. Neither in the past, nor now. Thank you. Remember what I told you, Frida? I said your future would be filled with nothing but happiness. I mean, I was full of crap. I left a whole bunch of money on this bet, but I'm really happy for you. Yeah, I, I do remember that. Everything feels like a dream now. Act 28. Act 28. Uh, this is the end. This is like, yeah, unforgettable summertime. Yeah, the un <laughs> unforgettable last act. Come on, hurry. It's about to begin. Oh, dear. She said, oh, dear, so many times. I think the parade has already started. I'm with me if you want to live it up at the parade. Oh, I'm so tired. Me too. My entire body is sore. <laughs> Don't say that in front of Poots. But I'm glad that the workers seem to be getting the hang of their jobs pretty quickly. All our guests seem to be very pleased too. Oh, and all our accommodations are fully booked. I'm glad to hear it. <laughs> I told you everyone was going to love it here. You were right. And you all made this possible. Thank you so much. Uh-oh. Someone's crying again. <laughs> no, no, I'm not. You can't laugh and cry at the same. Ha! Your who eyes are going to be swollen tomorrow. She's right. It's important to keep yourself in good condition right now. Uh, what are we going to do if we have even more guests lined up for to enter tomorrow morning? <sighs> these, these are tears of joy. Think about everything she's gone through up until now. It's understandable why she's so emotional. You're doing an awesome job right now, Frida. And try to look at it this way. There's nowhere for you to go but up. Uh, everyone... There's something I'd like to say. Yeah? Uh, would it be okay? Oh my fucking for, god. For, for, for me to call you my f f f friends? Uh, only it's if it's okay, only if it's okay with you. Ah, uh, that's the most incel behavior I've ever seen. Ah, uh, come on. Who says that with such a serious face? You scared me a bit. Of course we can be friends. I already thought we were friends, Frida. Thought she was going to make a big announcement or something. I can kill you in 47 different ways. Frida, we're already good friends of yours, you f***ing idiot. So don't hesitate to find us if you need anything. Okay, you idiot. Oh, <laughs> the ops! Oh. Explosions! Look! The fireworks started! I don't think I'll ever be able to forget this summer. Thank you for giving me incredible memories, Frida. What about the rest of them? What are they? Chopped liver? Uh, anyways, thanks, I guess. The eventful summer finally ended. They'll never find the bodies. Frida and her friends spent time together. And they'll never forget. Buried under this water park and all. Not everyone has returned to where they belong, but Frida learned something very valuable. She learned the true value of friendship, happiness, and how the evil amusement park owner can never get away with it thanks to those meddling kids. Aloha! This isn't a Scooby-Doo episode. It's time to greet our guests. Let's go! I'm doing my outro! I'm coming.